Welcome to Crowded Lab. Good news, everyone. Akumba Mail is back on AppSumo for a flash sale for a Black Friday event. This tool has great amount of positive reviews, though I will point out one important thing that you need to take into consideration. There is one recent review that highlighted some SMTP service issues in the security department. There are a few replies in this thread and the creators of the Akumba Mail responded that they planning to address the security concern. All right, so what is Akumba Mail? First of all, you will have email marketing software. You will be able to send SMS, though SMS part you need to purchase additionally. It is not included in AppSumo deal. You will be able to create landing pages and you will have ability to create surveys. Regarding deal structure, you have access to all of the features, well, except SMS, and then just see for yourself what license tier can be good for you. For example, maximum what you can have is tier 5 and half a million emails sent monthly. So let's proceed with actual review and demo of Akumba Mail. This is the main dashboard. Here you can see your recent campaigns. We can go to campaigns page to see more details. And before running your campaigns, you will need to create your lists. For example, let's use this one for a website newsletter. And right away, you can add subscribers manually or create a form. And this is a nice addition because you will be able to create different kind of forms and integrate that into your website. So let's create a pop-up, for example. Let's create one. You can choose some templates. And I believe, based on the name of the form, I was given some suggestions specifically for a newsletter. Let's use this simple one. We have few options. Let's proceed. You will be able to fully adjust your form to add images, add any buttons, but let's keep it as is for now. Let's go. And this is the final screen where we have our integration details. So I followed the integration process and integrated that into this particular blog post. You can integrate it in different ways, but for example, by clicking here, we'll have our subscription form. Let's subscribe. Then actually we got a confirmation email for our subscription from the email address that we specified. And yes, let's confirm. Going back to our lists, we now see one subscriber. Let's go to the subscribers list. Yes, here it is, our email. And this is just one example how you can add subscribers to your list. There are more options. You can import subscribers, for example, through CSV or Excel file, directly from text, add manually, from MailChimp lists or from Google Sheets. You can configure a webhook. So, for example, you can create different URLs to trigger different actions to subscribe or unsubscribe people from your list. And then you will be able to use that link in a form builder of your choice or in, for example, Typeform or in different kinds of integration software like Zapier and manage your lists of subscribers this way. So for your lists, you can also manage what kind of data you collect, for example, email, first name and date. You can manage forms integrated in Akumba Mail. You can create segments. For example, there will be paying clients or people in your list who didn't confirm monthly subscription yet. You can use different fields and then based on fields values, you can create segmentation inside your lists. Also for your lists, there are more custom options about notification settings, some branding colors. You can turn on and off confirmation email. Like we saw, I used a subscription form and then I got confirmation email. There is confirmation page settings and unsubscribe settings as well. Also, there is option to use Facebook audiences. And as we saw in advanced settings, we have webhooks, which I showed you. There is also list optimization settings 
where you have additional fine-tuned settings for your lists. So for example, if you can see that someone is not opening any of your emails, you can remove such subscribers. And there is additional cleaning option as well. All right, you have your lists configured. So let's move to campaigns. And here, different kinds of campaigns and newsletter, A-B testing emails, and with A-B testing, for example, you can set, let's say, 20% of your subscribers will receive test one email and another 20% will receive test two email. Then you can set up some conditions. Then based on these factors of your choice, the rest of the email list will receive the winning template. That's actually a very nice feature to have. So if you will go back to new campaign again, you can create a regular newsletter there are a few settings for regular campaigns, like custom subdomain for your links or integration with Google Analytics. Go next. You will then be prompted to select a subscriber list. Then inside that list, you will be able to choose some segments. I didn't create any, so this campaign will go to all members of this list. Then actually you will need to create a template. There are some saved ones. And you can browse the library of templates from Akumba Mail. There are close to 1000 of templates ready. And as well, you can import a template from URL. You can upload HTML or import it from zip file. But let's choose some pre-built template. I like this one. Now we have ability to configure the design of our template. We can modify the layout and settings. We can also add unsubscribe elements. And let's go next. We can test our campaign as well. We can preview our campaign. And as well, we can test in devices. Let's launch the test. And this is great great number of devices and softwares very extensive list for example we can see how our template will look like in iphone 14 and in many other devices for example we can see how our template will look like in gmail we can preview how it will look like in microsoft outlook a very nice feature to have we have our campaign url and let's actually send the campaign Let's go to report. Here you will be able to see detailed analytics. So inside the report for a particular campaign, you will see quick summary, status of deliverability, sent emails. We can see general information like number of unsubscribers, unique clicks. Also at advanced section, we will be able to see device opening, a map of countries and other different statistics. I had only one email, so we don't have any statistics here. Another nice feature, click map. We will see here where our subscribers clicked on the email actually. And if they click important links like Facebook, X, links that you marked to track. And here are actually tracking URLs that you can add. And also you will see subscriber details. And moreover, you will be able to see the email that is being sent by this link in the browser. All right, moving next to templates. Here you will be able to see, adjust and modify all the templates and you can save those into my templates area. Okay, next feature, automations. We can create new one and here we can define different actions. For example, let's use website newsletter list and we can choose different kind of triggers. Do something on a specific date when a subscriber is considered to be added into a segment that we define or just when new subscriber enters the list. Let's use this one, apply. Then we can do different kind of actions. We can put a delay, let's say send a follow-up email in a day, 
in the one day we will send a particular template email let's say in a day we would like to send a welcome email template let's select this one let's apply then what kind of actions we can have we can do conditions we can do conditions based on behavior like if campaign is not opened or opened you can do different kind of actions on different campaigns or we can add a rule let's say if email contains something we can put for example spam domain we can put a condition then based on some conditions for example we can send sms message or let's say we can send request to some webhook all right moving to the next feature smtp so by default akumba mail uses their own servers to send emails however if you would like to have more control and uh, let's say to avoid some file upload size issues if you send large files with your emails in large quantities maybe you would like to configure your own smtp server and you can do that with akumba mail so here at configure section you can actually see all of the benefits of own smtp relay so you can set up it from this page all right moving next to sms section in order to be able to send sms campaigns you will need to buy credits for example 12 dollars for 250 sms messages i think it also could be nice if they would allow to integrate sms providers like twilio but anyway if you will need to send sms campaigns this functionality is here as well and here you will have additional settings where you will be able to manage your sms receivers all right moving to another feature that akumbo mail provides it is pages we can create a new page there are templates available let's start with this one let's go we will be able to define different metrics like google analytics tracking parameters go next We will be able to have full control of how our page looks like and be able to modify and adjust that let's go next move into published state and then you can access your pages by the specific url or you can add a custom domain which is great so you build your landing pages here and those are available through a custom domain for example here it is our landing page very nice looking one and you will be able to add here let's say newsletter form or whatever you need all right moving to yet another feature surveys let's create new one let's go here you will be able to design your survey preview how it will look like moving next we'll have options of different style of questions let's add new question add in this question as well and let's go next we can copy url and load our survey then send result there are additional options how you can integrate your surveys for example into landing pages or newsletter let's check landing pages let's choose this one and to add a survey to a landing page you will need to edit a particular template and then you will be able to add it like this so we can drag and drop it here add survey choose a particular one that we created and confirm go next to share and let's test it scrolling down to our survey of course you will need to play a bit with styling to integrate it nicely into your page but anyway great feature to have so you can add ratings and collect feedback right from your landing pages just quick overview of integration 
Here you will be able to create and manage your webhooks. Just an example of hook that I've added. Here we can see that the action will be add subscriber, but you can have other functionality. This is a custom made JSON format. You need to define field value and actual value, and you can add and modify that on the fly. For example, let's add last name and that value last name will appear in the dropdown and you will be able to map values from your webhook to the fields for your subscribers in email list. For example, collect an email and name of subscribers. Additionally, you can configure content sources. For example, you can add RSS or Atom sources, let's say for a newsfeed, or you can upload that as a file. All right, moving to a conclusion. So Akumba Mail is a email marketing powerhouse. It has everything you need to be able to run your email campaign successfully. You can configure your email lists, collect subscribers using their built-in forms or webhooks. You can create campaigns using nice looking visual email builder. There are a lot of pre-built templates to choose from. A very nice feature that I like is testing view. So you will be able to preview how your email will look like in different devices at the same time. Additionally, you will be able to set up automations for your emails. Let's say one day after you have got new subscriber, you would like to greet that person with a welcome email. You can set up this kind of automations with Akumba Mail. You will have detailed statistics about your campaigns. If needed, you can also use your own SMTP servers. And the deal structure is pretty clear and straightforward as well. Just see for yourself what number of emails you would like to send monthly. So that's it for this Akumba Mail review and demo. Please give this video a like and subscribe for more similar videos. As usual, the link to this tool is in the description. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.